154 years ago today, April 14th, Abraham Lincoln died. News reached Brattleboro where 34-year-old William Czar Bradley II was living. Bradley, born in Brattleboro in 1831, had been writing poems and essays his entire life. He was voted Harvard class poet when he graduated in 1851 and was to become the first library director of the yet-to-be-constructed Brooks Memorial Library in 1887. In his book, Short Poems, compiled by his niece, Sarah B. Tyson, in 1894, he wrote of his feelings for the slain president in a poem called Lincoln's Death. Lincoln's Death I heard a mighty people sob and sigh, a sad, a wild, a mournful thing to hear. It smote into my heart a sudden fear. A nation wept with a continuous cry of universal grief. No succor nigh, as if the waves of ocean flocking near had all bewailed a lost one on his bier, and rolled their plaint beneath an empty sky. O oh, boundless trouble, said I, what thou art, since know I must, to hear the worst I crave. Then like the murmur from one breaking heart, that wailing came, a faint reply it gave. We bury thus a common friend, most dear, and follow him with weeping to the grave.